Hello and welcome to a quick training video on how to use Grammarly. Every course page will have a Grammarly link in it. Simply click on it and you'll be taken right to the Grammarly page. The existing users, those that have already signed in, can use the login, but as a new user you'll need to create an account. Enter your name, whatever you'd like to be called within Grammarly. Make sure you use your Coleman University email address, otherwise you will not be given access to this paid site. Select a password that you will be able to remember because Coleman University will not be able to access it for you. And go ahead and leave the access code blank. Once you see this page, check your email to gain authorization to use Grammarly. Click on the Verify Email button. Grammarly will then open and you have the choice to either upload documents directly, type in a new document, or as we suggest, you can review a demo document in Grammarly. Inside each of the Grammarly pages you'll see a number of options. You can add new materials, copy, download, Make choices as to what types of document controls you want, including punctuation and structure. Turning on plagiarism, which is turned off by default. We strongly recommend turning this on. If you'd like to improve your writing, you can also turn on the vocabulary enhancement option. Clicking new will allow you to type directly onto the web page. We don't really recommend this. I think you will find that by using more powerful word processors like, say, Word, you'll be able to do a lot more in a lot less time. But it is an option available to you. From the Grammarly home page, you can take a look at work you've typed in manually, download it onto your local computer, delete it, or again, Upload new work, modify your profile, take the tutorial if you need to, or log out. That's all you need to know in order to use Grammarly to help you improve your writing. Good luck.